tax on oil and gas um, is fairly high in Norway. We have three elements of securing um, that the incomes are to the benefit of the people. That would say uh, to the benefit of, of the state. The most important one is, of course, that we tax all the income of the oil and gas companies. Um, then, we, in addition, the government holds a share of every license or every potentially big license that is provided for the private companies. So if you have big international oil companies, maybe we put the license together and Shell might hold 30 percent and then British Petroleum might hold 30 percent and then the Norwegian government might hold 40 percent. We never operate uh, through, uh, through these resources. We are just, uh, we just own them. And we do our part of the cost. We need to pay for the search. We need to pay for the development. But in the end, it will be uh, another source of direct income from natural resources on the Norwegian continental shelf. And um, the last source is, of course, uh, the shares that we hold in one of the largest players on the Norwegian continental shelf, the Statoil, which used to be uh, an all-national oil company operating only on the, on the Norwegian continental shelf. Now it's at the Oslo Stock Ex Exchange. We hold two-thirds of the stocks and the company operates globally. The ma marginal tax on oil and gas in Norway is 78%. But it is also a system which gives the companies great possibilities to deduct. All uh, expenses are deductible and all investments are deductible is possible to deduct in a fairly short amount uh, of time. So even if the level is high, it is still uh, interesting to invest. Uh, and uh, all the large players, uh, international uh, companies, are present at the Norwegian continental shelf today. Uh, many of them invest, like in Ecofisk, where they invested $10, million, $10 billion uh, this year and they still, makes, they still make heaps of money. Uh, I think that just as important when it comes to taxation, just as important as the level of taxation is, um, uh, is the fact that so you need to trust, you need the trust, the long-term trust. If you are to invest billions and billions of dollars, you need to know that the system wouldn't change overnight. So we also put great pride into the fact that we do not change the system every now and then. We are a uh, reliable partner. They know what they get when they come to Norway and they know what they don't get when they, when they come to Norway. And I, I think this is a fairly, it's a fair, it's a fair deal.